So hey guys, today I'm going to be talking about the trickster pack which I put up on my pay hip and it's going to include the following items. First we have uh, two after effects scripts which I'll talk about more in a second. Then we have a script user guide which will show you guys where to paste the script as well as how to change them so that they use your Twixture and RSMB settings. And finally we have uh, three tutorials on how to fix Twixture warps which I'll also talk about in a minute. So first of all, so the script is basically 50 lines of JavaScript which I have coded and what it does is six time remap keyframes together to the least extra frames you'll understand what i mean in a bit pre-composes adds twixter with whichever settings you chose in the script pre-composes again adds rsmb with again whichever settings you chose uh, this one is optional depending on which script you're using enables time remapping then adds keyframes in the correct position so that you could use them to time remap directly and all of that in just one click so here's a demonstration of me using the script okay so let's say you have this clip right here that you want to twixture what you want to do is pre-compose it first then enable time remapping and put a keyframe every time the character moves so like this and after that you just need to select a keyframe go to window then choose uh, whichever one you want with or without rsmb i'll choose this one and now you can just stretch these two keyframes and time map the clip however you want and finally for the tutorials uh, in the first one i cover how to fix the warping when the background is irrelevant using the first method for the second tutorial, I cover how to fix the warp pin in smaller objects like particles or eyes using the second method. And in the third tutorial, I cover how to fix the warp pin when the scene is very complex and there's an overlapping of foregrounds using the third method.